Numbers are very important to us. They give us a way of understanding size, how large or how small things are. They also help us understand what is happening when things increase or decrease in size. Numbers are the building blocks of everything in maths and everything in the world. Numbers allow us to understand the quantities of things we use all the time. Money, weight, distance and time. Our whole lives are based on numbers so we need to be able to use them well. To show how numbers interact with each other, we have four basic operations. Addition, subtraction, multiplication and division. Knowing how and when to use these can help us and save us a lot of time in life. A good way to get started with numbers is with a number line. It helps us understand increases and decreases in values. Let's see how each of these operations can be shown on the number line. Firstly, addition. This is represented by the plus sign. You'll know this from the volume control on your phone and on your TV's remote control. We use it to increase the quantity of something by adding another amount. The opposite is the minus sign. This represents subtraction. We use it to decrease the quantity of something by taking away an amount. In the real world, we often have to deal with very large quantities. We're lucky though, as we have multiplication to help us. We can multiply numbers together to save time, adding things over and over again. This allows us to show increases in quantity in a quick and efficient way. If you're earning £5 an hour at work and your friend is earning seven times as much, how much is she being paid? Finally, we have division. This is simply the opposite of multiplication. It represents quantities being divided up or shared out. It is much faster and easier than subtracting numbers over and over again. Let's say you have 24 bottles of lemonade and you want to share them out equally with six friends. You can work out how many bottles each person gets using division. 24 divided by six gives us four bottles per person. To recap what we've learned. Addition and multiplication are operations we use to handle increases in quantity. Subtraction and division are used to handle decreases.